Hello everyone, Makai here, bringing you a Mindful Cooking with Makai episode from our new RV. Since we were all limited because of the pandemic, my parents bought an RV and we hit the road from Pennsylvania to California and back. Our trip was full of adventures. We got to catch up with old friends and make new ones. I also got a chance to meet the brothers Corin while my mom was recording her very first songs in Ojai, California. I even got to be in the studio and sing back up. Check out my mom's first single song called Fallen to Fly by Heather Lundberg. You can access this music on Spotify, iTunes, or wherever you access your music online. Now, for today's episode, we've been cooking a lot in our RV, and we also ate amazing food on our trip. Some of my favorites were Lynchburg, Tennessee at Barrel House Barbecue and Bite Me Barbecue in Wichita, Kansas. For today's episode, I am bringing you a homemade barbecue sauce with sweet and a little bit of heat for your next barbecue. Let's jump into cooking. And so first you have your two cups of ketchup. Put this in. And then you have your half cup of apple cider vinegar, your a quarter cup of packed brown sugar. Also, if you put a marshmallow in the brown sugar, it can keep it moisturized if you're going to set it on the counter or if you're going to use it later for your cooking. And then two tablespoons of honey, one tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce or coconut aminos, a tablespoon of lemon juice, and a teaspoon of Stonehouse seasoning. Now the Stonehouse seasoning is easy. It's just salt, pepper, and garlic powder. So you just add this in, and then the last ingredient is hot sauce. Now, if you don't like heat, then don't add it to your recipe. But if you do like heat, then you can add as much as you'd like. So we can open this. About a quarter teaspoon. So now I'm gonna stir this barbecue sauce mixture all the way in till it's like that. And then I'm going to transfer a spatula to a wooden spoon for the heat. So I'm going to put this on medium heat. So while that still want to be stirring, once you've stirred it fully like this, then you want to leave it until it comes into a boil. Once this comes into a boil, then simmer it for 10 minutes. You had me a barbecue. I'm telling you, it's the best darn barbecue sauce in town. While this is finishing up, let's talk about our mindful tip. Our mindful tip for today is about letting go. In my experience, letting go of home was kind of hard. I mean, it's exciting to go away more than 9,000 miles for something cool and new, but there can be some fear with leaving home. Remember, you are living in the present, and wherever you go is where you are. You can have awesome adventures and not have to disconnect your mind to home. You don't have to forget places you love to release and experience joy exploring new places. Don't let fear hold you back from having your own adventures. Once your sauce is ready, then you can slather it with any of your favorite barbecue. I'm going to taste test this product with chicken wings. Tastes like a mindful chef did it. 
If you wanna have your barbecue sauce right now, then you can serve it immediately. If you wanna have it later, then you can store it in an airtight container. Thank you for watching my special RV cross country mindful cooking with Makai episode. And don't forget to subscribe and slice that like button. Oh